welcome to this review for Backblaze, brought to you by bestbackups.com. Now, Backblaze is a five-year-old company based in California, in San Mateo to be exact, and they managed to get a lot of publicity, so you'll probably hear about them on the internet if you're generally kind of reading about online backups, especially because they offer unlimited data for only $3.96 a month. That's if you pay up front, though. Um, however, if you pay monthly, it's only $5 a month. So for unlimited data, that is actually the best price that we've seen. Um, in terms of the service, I've looked around for at uh, reviews by other users, and generally, they seem to be quite happy with it. And uh, their customer service replied within 2 hours and 50 minutes when we contacted them. So all around, generally, a very good service. So... Just going to check out what the software is like, how easy it is to use. So um, let's start off with uh, a sign up and downloading of the free trial. So just submitting my details now. And does that really not work with Enter? Apparently not. So I have to click on the button. That's a bit weird, I think. They really should allow you to. Um, press enter when you're submitting the form. Um, so a bit of a minus point there from me. <clears throat> okay, so it's just downloading. The software is 7.3 megabytes, which is probably about medium size. Um, seen software that's 500 kilobytes, and I've seen software that's 30 meg, so generally in the middle. And <clears throat> download speeds are good, which is a good first sign for a backup company. And they've got a nice little guide here of how to install the software. <clears throat> now I'm on a Mac, so you're going to be seeing the Mac software. Okay, that's downloaded now, it's just unzipping. Just give me a second, okay, that should be unzipped now. Here we go, Backblaze installer, open. Okay. Yes, I've actually, this is one of the first companies that actually recognizes my account right after I download. I'm very happy with that, that I don't have to enter my details again. Definitely a plus there, because most companies, you download the software, you have to log in again, despite the fact that I've just signed up, they can see my IP address, so I really don't understand why they can't do an auto login, so well done Backblaze for doing that. For me, it's always the small differences that show you how much a company cares and how good they are in the long run. So let's see how it installs. Um, I've got nothing else running, it's a bit slow though. Okay, it's taking a few minutes and just got some nice pictures of what's going to happen. First backup will take a few days or weeks depending on my internet speed. Great. Okay, um, this is taking a while so Let's take a look at around their site first. Um, what I've found is, let's look at um, kind of contacting them. On Twitter, they are very active. So as bestbackups.com, I have managed to, um, to get in contact with Backblaze, and they replied on Twitter. So they are active on social media. OK, sorry, this is just finished, so I'll just run it. OK. Um, after I just clicked on Finish, I don't have any apps running except for this thing up here. And so I've installed it and it never asked me for any preferences. So, I mean, it's nice for a simple user, you know, let's see what they're automatically backing up. Backblaze preferences. Um, let's just pause the backup for now. What are they backing up? Um, settings. Right, so you install the software and automatically they're backing up the entire hard disk. Which, um, I mean, I don't really want to back up my whole hard disk because it's got a bunch of files from OS X, it's got a bunch of files from software, so that's a lot of files that I don't really need to back up. So I don't think that's necessarily a good thing that they, um, they automatically back up your whole hard disk. And I can't yet find anywhere to select which folders I want to back up, which is a bit annoying. Performance, let's see. Um, they're going to back up approximately 4 gigabytes a day, but I can actually set a throttle, so that's great. 
Backup when on battery power, so that's the usual option on laptops, which is really good. Don't want to base battery time or battery power generally. Schedule. So continuously they've got they probably monitor which files change and then they upload them when they change, or once a day, or when I click back up now. So generally, I mean it's not um you can't set you know weekly backups or monthly backups or like really specific ones, but I mean what the stuff you need, it's there. Exclusions. Ah, I see. So they do actually exclude some folders. That's great. Okay, very. I'm happy about that. After all, then. Okay, so here they sh they're showing that it's only the hard drive that's backed up, but actually they are excluding the um, files that I don't really use. So that's great. Security. You can have your own private key. That's good. And wow, reports. Um, I haven't seen many of these before, so it's very good. You can actually track how much stuff you're going to upload. Um, looking at me, I mean, movies is the biggest one. That's a surprise. So <clears throat> it's all the features are there that you'd really need for a backup. Um, that's generally the software then. Um, so we've checked out Twitter. Their site, I think, is quite nice. It's kind of got that Web 2.0 feel. Um, and, you know, not, I mean, there's only five options on, sorry, seven options on the menu. Um, and it's got a nicely laid out description. It's got videos of their offices and of their staff. So definitely thumbs up on their website. In fact, I'd say it's probably, I mean, I love their logo. <laughs> it's just really cool. And I love their site. So that's one of my favorite sites for backups. Okay, take a look at the pricing. Um, it's three ninety six a month if you pay for two years up front and unlimited backups. So that's crazy value for money. Um, if you pay for one year, it's five seventeen and five dollars a month, which is also crazy good. Um, they, uh, I know they are expanding pretty quickly. There was an article recently about how. Uh, they uh, they couldn't find any hard disks when there were floods in Thailand, so um, they were going around buying hard disks in Best Buy and stuff. And I mean, they are adding, I think, three terabytes of data a day, or they were when they wrote the article. So they are growing pretty quickly. Um, got some nice T-shirts as well. So it's nice that they're kind of you can find out everything about the team on the website. and they've raised five million. Good for them. So uh, that's generally the, the website. I think that's a, that review is a bit shorter than the usual ones, but that's because Backblaze are kind of a great company with a very simple software and website, so you can check them out. Um, and I'll just show you my site for a second. This is bestbackups.com. If you'd like to see a written review about Backblaze, go on the front page and you can just read it here. It's nice and in detail, pretty long. And obviously, if you like them, then click on Visit Site and sign up. Thanks for listening.